What's going on guys and welcome back to some more Mario Golf of the Game Boy Color in the last part. Uh, we basically did uh, some of the side mediums in the Palms Club uh, practice course. In this part we're going to do the uh, Palms Club tournament. Now, um, I don't think the Palms Club is that much of a step up in difficulty from the Marion Club, but um, the Palms Club's whole game is that's more tropical oriented and uh, Fun fact, uh, the music that I praised in the last part, this music actually does play in Mario Golf 64 when you hit, hit, when you play four players, it's all Yoshi or all Donkey Kong, but uh, it's, always, it's fantastic music either way, but uh, we have a, dr a drive increase in the last cup, so uh, maybe we might, we might even have an easier time with this than we do with the Marion course, I don't know, I think this game is one of those games that starts off kind of hard, but will progressively get easier, I don't know, it's one, maybe it might be one of those games, but uh, I'm gonna put a backspin in that. That's enough to reach the green, though. Yeah, I probably should have used the higher club, but, uh. Yeah. And a little to the left, and, uh. Oh, I overshot that one, but at least it's an easy par. Now, I'll uh, see, um. Alright, um. There we go, Larry, Larry Koopa. Oh look, there's Falco from Star Fox 64. There's Metal Mario. There's a, uh, there's a, uh, I'm trying to think. There's a uh, Falco, there's Ludwig, there's Fox, there's Bubba, there's a uh, Charlie from Mario Golf War. there's Wendy O. Koopa, there's Slippy from Star Fox 64, there's a uh, Pigma from Star Fox 64, and that's about all of the video game references I've noticed. But I guess this is like Mario. I guess this can be like Mario Golf 64, where like they just reference other games in the scoreboard. A lot of Star Fox 64 references in that. Uh, I'd love to do a Star Fox 64 playthrough at some point, but uh, it'd be a shorter playthrough. But I don't have plans to do it like at the moment. But I'd love to do it eventually. Come on, go in, go in, go in, go in, go in. Yes! I chipped in for Eagle, yes. Oh my god, yes. We're on the ramp right now, so uh We didn't get a perfect at we didn't get perfect power unfortunately, but uh I'm I'm so happy with chip for eagle. We're not gonna eagle this hole unfortunately, we don't have enough distance. We might actually, uh no, when we we're not gonna hold our hopes up. We're not gonna eagle. We can't make that green in two. We're not the right stats. So yeah, this should be, this should do it. I'm not gonna put all the power all the way though. But um, oh my god, I almost hit that eagle for second time. A second time. That would be even funnier. But it's an easy birdie at least. So we're on the map and we're in uh, second place actually behind Sherry. Grace is going to be our rival in the uh, Palms Club, but uh, that's a story for next video. Anyway, so what we're gonna do now is, uh, let's see. I'm gonna, um, what I'm gonna do, I think I'm gonna use a five iron, not hit it all the way. That's like a bad accuracy, so I might, that might not, it's gonna go on the green at least. It's barely gonna go on the green. It's not even gonna go on the green. Probably uh, a riskier shot. Oh yeah! Now we're in the lead. That's our second chip in. Come on, that's far from the hole. It's a little bit of a tough putt. It's not too bad of a putt, but uh. Ooh, I should, I thought I had a, uh... at least it's an easy par, but uh. We're still in the lead, so uh, hole six is a uh... 15 mile per hour win though, but um, I'm gonna see use a power shot, but at least I don't have to use a power shot. Two. 
I'm gonna use a three iron. I'm not really too confident in uh, my ability to get a four iron. Uh, yeah, I don't know, but uh, 94, 98. So I'm just gonna use a three and not hit it all the way. So they aimed it too much to the left. I need to aim much more to the left with this. But it's going downhill, so like this. Oh yeah. I would race for first place, so uh we use another power shot, but uh I don't think we're gonna eagle this hole though. It's great we got the chip in for eagle because uh we're not ha the wind's not really in our favor in these part fives. Well actually, um we can maybe risk it, but uh good chance it, but uh yeah, we needed a perfect shot if we need any chance with that one, but uh, I don't even think that's going to reach the green. Try, um... I... Well, that was worth the shot at least, but it's an easy birdie. And we're in the lead. That's, e that's great. So, um... I'm just gonna use a uh two I'm gonna hit it all the way. Actually I fucked up that timing, so it's gonna I overshot that, let's just say. I will say we we definitely overshot that. My goal is to uh not confident of full power that's gonna make that, so yeah. We have we're seven under par, we're only like uh we're only like uh what am I trying to say? We're only, we're not even halfway through this, so we're doing very well. I think we're even doing better than the Marion Club. Well, I guess we need more distance, actually, so it's easier to get birdies. I don't think this is gonna reach, it could reach the green. Maybe I aimed it too much to the left, though. Actually, oh yeah, that's an easy birdie right there. Actually, maybe not, actually. It's a little left, but uh, there we go, that's an easy birdie. I'm at the turn, so uh I'm gonna load to the left, but uh let's try to see if we can put some top in into that. I fucked up and put it in the tree, but uh it's average distance, but let's just say, but uh Oh, well, I knew I was, I was gonna, I knew I was gonna have to use a lower club with that one, but uh... Oh my god, oh my god, oh my god, that happened a second time! Two times in one tournament, that's amazing! Jesus, I never get this lucky in Mario Golf, let's just say, but that happened two times. Maybe I should have used a higher club, I don't know, but uh... That's a doable, at least. I think we just need to, uh... Backspin into that. We overshot it, but it's not too bad. Actually, it didn't go on the green. Oh yeah, easy, great birdie right there. We're, we're 11 under par. We're doing phenomenal, let's just say. Up on the water, actually. Oh yeah, that's our first water hazard. I probably should have just gone with the higher club, but um, unfortunately, our luck's gonna run out because we hit it in the water. But we, but we're, but that's a nice bogey right here. We're far ahead, though. Uh, Actually, uh, we're four, we're like, for every, like, we didn't, we only parred two holes, we bogeyed one hole, so we're doing phenomenal, let's just say. I'm gonna hit him more to the right. Alright, 100, okay, we can, we can do this, we can get that, uh, get, uh, yeah, I'm gonna have to uh, hit it like this. Oh, 
I want that eagle, and even still, I overshot that. That's not no eagles for us, though. We got two chipped in eagles, so we shouldn't get too too much of our hopes up. But um, I'm actually believe it or not, this is like part five, and I'm recording. This is like the fifth part of this playthrough, and I'm actually recording this uh, before the first part even goes up. And um, so I'm recording this uh, relatively a week in advance, let's just say. But um. Might be the last recording session I do this week, but I'm actually recording this on Thursday. Maybe I'll do one more recording session. I don't know. Mario, this is gonna be a shorter playthrough. I know that for a fact, but um, oh my god. Okay, I shouldn't have gotten my hopes up. Maybe with the, if I a little more to the left, I would have gone in, but uh, 12 under par. We're doing phenomenal. We're going downhill, so I'm gonna use a. Uh, what I'm gonna do is I'm gonna use a uh, five iron. Cause I way undershot that one. We don't even chip that, unfortunately. But uh, yeah, that's an easy par, though. Our easy par and. Uh, and uh, we're three more holes left, but uh, we're gonna. I'm just gonna use a uh, power shot because uh, this is a sweet, sweeter spot. I only use power shot. I mostly use power shots in part five because no fuck up the accuracy. But uh, that's not. That's gonna go in the fucking bunker. Anyway, so that didn't go in the bunker, thankfully. But uh, I'm gonna have to use a higher club with that one, though. I fucked up the accuracy once again. Alright, so that's a little bit of a tough pop of it's doable at least. Maybe a little more to the right that would have gone in, but uh, that's an easy par. Alright, this is a par five. This is our last chance to get it, get it on the green in two. We're not gonna get I don't think we're gonna get it on the green in two, unfortunately. Oh shit! Yeah, uh I don't know what's wrong with the why the color's changing, uh Sometimes my Retro Tink 5X does this. Uh, I'm almost done with the part, so shh. Uh, yeah, I'm gonna do the rest of the cup like this. Sorry for the uh, oh, epilepsy warnings, but uh, sometimes when I'm playing the Game Boy Color and the Retro Tink, it'll just kind of go out like this, but uh, I'm gonna do the rest of the cup like this. Sometimes chaotic recordings turn out to be better, but we got a, uh, we got an ego right there. Oh my god. Sorry for this, but, uh, I, I'm doing the rest of the cup, I guess. I'm not starting the recording over because I'm having faulty, like, um... It's only this game that's affected by it, to be honest. One more hole left, so I'm gonna do the rest of the cup like this. Oh shit. All right, easy par, and we won the Palms Tournament, so, um... Alrighty, so we're gonna, you know, we're gonna get, uh... Uh, I'd rather, uh... All right, so we won the Palms Tournament, at, however, uh, yeah, sorry for the coloring issue. Sometimes it's a problem with my upscaler, let's say. Oh, wait a minute, it's flickering again. Unfortunately, this is gonna be the last video I record in this session because unfortunately, uh, I'm gonna do the rest of the video like this, but uh, it, it does, it's better if it doesn't happen at the very end, but uh, yeah, so I'm gonna cut it off for this part of Mario Golf Game Boy Color. So next time Mario Golf Game Boy Color, actually, let me just uh, try to see if we can uh, 
go there, but uh, oh my god. Anyway, so uh, next time we're going to the color, we're going to face Grace. See you guys then.